we have on the phone right now, CSET Heights Borough Administrator John Camara. John, what can you tell us what's going on there? Only that it's a really serious structural fire that appears to have started, as best I can tell, on the privately owned Funtown Pier area, but is rapidly spreading. And my only conversation with one of the emergency workers up there very briefly was that it's a serious, full structural fire and that it is uh, spreading and they're having trouble containing it and it's uh, moving on to our uh, public boardwalk, which as I'm sure you know, has just been rebuilt after being completely destroyed by Sandy. So oh. it's uh, just a horrible situation. Um, thankfully, I can't say for certain, but I can say what I can say for certain is only that I have not heard of any injuries at this point and am hopeful that, uh, you know, no people are injured or um, worse from this. But the damage to the property sounds uh, devastating. Certainly so. Um John, we're looking at live pictures right now of the fire that is still, I mean, cl clearly still out of control. There's thick, dense black smoke. At this point, do you know how many businesses um, have been damaged or how many businesses now that are, are, that are on fire? I do not have any numbers like that. I can tell you, and probably so many people are familiar with that, our boardwalk in that area, but it's very, very densely populated mm -hmm. with structures so there's yeah. small structures shoulder to shoulder um, lined up so that's the problem the boardwalks made out of wood most of the construction on the buildings is wood and the uh, I'm sure it's spreading and that's the word I got from our workers of course up here in the office we're trying not to <laughs> bother the emergency workers sure. that are down there trying to control this thing but a quick call from one of our uh, workers who's also the fire chief um, let me know that the it, it is really bad and he was heading up there with some construction equipment to try to um, you know to, uh, to start to contain the spread of the fire and it just breaks your heart look at this picture here this is that the very <laughs> playground where the kids were playing they had just put all this money into the area wow. after the devastation to rebuild it so proudly governor christie standing in front of all of the hard work that had been done saying we are back we are strong and now this happens right right uh, um you know uh, uh, Governor Christie's wife was there as she helped nail in the last plank of wood before the season began. You know, the initial project to repair all this, $3.6 million just to replace the boards and the railings um, a a around that area. This doesn't even include the cost to help the businesses mm -hmm. during Sandy. And now, unfortunately, dealt another devastating blow. I'll tell you, you know, the the wind gust reports that I was seeing were 15 miles an hour. Mm -hmm. It does look stronger. We're getting reports from the ground. Firefighters are having trouble based on that wind. I think what has happened now, that thunderstorm I told you about that went over Monmouth County, uh, when you are near a thunderstorm, sometimes that thunderstorm is ventilating and you know you get downdrafts from right. that thunderstorm. I uh -huh. think that is now enhancing some of the winds, unfortunately, right there uh, near that fun town pier. So probably some wind gusts over 25 miles an hour now. You see yeah. the firefighters trying to attack it from several places, you know, from the north side of it, from the west side of it but almost from the south side of it all of this flames right next to ironically all this water right there that right. they just can't get on it uh, it's just a fire that is burning right now basically out of control along the boardwalk but they are trying to contain it to keep it from spreading beyond the area that you can see on the camera right now it is remarkable to see I mean, as we said this fire started around 2 30 this afternoon and you can see how massive it started in one business um, inside the uh, Coors wow. cu custard ice cream stand there Been there for a long, um, long time. Iconic mm -hmm. uh, ice cream. Everyone would stop there and get some ice cream. And just how quickly it has spread.